guys so welcome back to my channel i'm half i'm half hola guys welcome back to my channel so today i have a dollar tree haul to share with you guys i was planning to do it to try to do it with my glasses on but it's not gonna work so hold on okay now my nose is red from wearing my glasses all day today anyways guys i know i know that you already saw the new crazy look that i have going on but as you already know um about my son and if you haven't already you can check my videos where it says update on my son and it'll give you um the details of what happened to my son but anyways so i took my hair off i did not dye my hair blonde a lot of people are asking me what color this is it was my hair was super gray already once they cut all the the, the black that i have dyed and all that stuff everything was just gray and um um they just bleached it and toned it so this is the color i'm really trying to just get it white so i might go back i just couldn't handle the i don't know what that is i couldn't handle the weird the bleach anymore so that's why it has this color anyways i have a dollar tree haul to share with you guys and yes i am home this is my background that i usually record from um here for another four days i had to come get my infusions and my shots and they are trying to work out something where i can do my stuff at home inject myself and so yeah um and i'll be heading home in the next four days rushing back with to my son joel and so to give you guys a little quick update because you guys deserve to know what's going on with my son because you guys are just amazing amazing and amazing youtube family there's so many of you that i connect with like if i known you forever and i am eternally grateful for you guys you have no idea you guys keep me moving you motivate me you make me feel all kinds of way and i'm sorry if i get emotional but um whew. Lord Jesus, it's always so hard to talk about my son. So today makes two months that my son has been in the hospital after his motorcycle accident. My son is not in a coma. I just wanted to clear that because um, a lot of people ask me that. So my son was taken off sedation about um, two weeks after his surgery and all that stuff. Um, and my son opens he cannot open his i'm trying to think his left eye um his right eye he opens and he looks like he's looking around but he's not aware of his surroundings you know how like when we wake up and be like hey mom how long have you been there you know stuff like that no my son just stares around and um but god is so good god is so good god just guys just I always remember and if you don't believe in god i'm not here to judge you that's those are my beliefs but you guys for those of you that send me prayers others send me good vibes good energy and i take it all and i respect each and one of you for what you believe i'm not here to judge anybody i respect everyone for who they are so i'm a big believer um i have faith i you know my son I believe that all the prayers are coming through. God is working on Joel, and Joel will be a walking testimony for God. My son um, has been trying to mumble things, but you can't hear my son exactly when, like, when he's talking or whatever. So they put a speech box, and you can make out some things, you know. So. Um, but it's not like he's sitting there having a conversation with you. He just starts mumbling things like, you know, or moving lips and not saying anything. I wish I knew how to read lips. Um, but he has been moving fingers, his feet, his toes. And, um, he says like little words, if you keep telling him things, he'll try to repeat them. And, um, 
I'm sorry guys, this is just really hard for me. Because as a mom, I always have that fear, you know, of how much Joe is going to be able to do. But I try to stay strong for my family, for my son, and I keep pushing my boy all the time. So, um, this is supposed to be a Dollar Tree haul. But anyways, I just wanted to update you guys because you guys asked me and you want to know about Joel. And I just wanted to bring up because for some people, there might be little things. And I hate when people tell me, oh my God, that's all he's doing. It's been two months. And to me, it's like, oh my God, look what he's doing. Like, yes. Thank you, Jesus. So, um... Yeah, guys. So today, being the two months that he's there, my daughter goes to check on Joel every time because she knows how I am. And because she loves her brother, you know. And she FaceTimes me all the time with my son. And today, he looked a little confused. I don't know if it was the hair. <laughs> he was just like, you know, staring. Like he could just... He could have just been staring away the way he normally does. But today he looked a little confused and I was trying to clarify, like, yes, it's me. And But he knows that mom does crazy things. It's not a surprise to him. And my daughter was like, it's mom. Say hi to mom. It's mom, you know. And she's like, look, say hi to mom. And mom is telling you she loves you. Like, look at her. And he was pushing mumbling lips to the point where we heard him say, and I've been praying to God every day for this. Like, God, I just want to walk into the room and see him say, hi, mom, that he's, I'll take it whichever way he gives it to me. So my daughter had him on FaceTime and he was able to mumble the words, hi, mom. Guys, you have no idea, like, not too long ago, he had therapy too. I mean, it's not like, I don't want you guys to think like he's, hi, mom, like a clear, he struggles, you know, to repeat something. But not too long ago, too, he had, they sit him up to try to push him, you know, they sit him up on the bed. He needs support. He needs to be held. He cannot be let go. They need to hold his head up because he can't hold it up. But he was moving his fingers and I, he stopped for a little bit and they were like, come on, Joel, like keep pushing. And I tell him, come on, you got this. Keep pushing, you know, and I grab his fingers and. He was trying so hard to just. To grab my hand. Anyways, guys, I didn't come here to cry. I came here to give you a Dollar Tree haul, guys. So I'm just going to grab stuff. This sign was up there and I never got the chance to take it down. So that's why it's sitting there on my stuff. So let's start. I grabbed these because I've been looking for them since I was in Chicago because I want them for my granddaughter. She's probably going to watch my video. Maybe not because I'll probably be back home over there by the time um, she sees this video. But it says I need space. <laughs> How cute. So Lilo and Stitch. Stitch. This is Stitch. Because I don't see Lilo. I don't know. Don't mind me, guys. And then I saw this. And then this is the Sweet Floral Scented Champagne Toast. I grabbed it because it says Champagne Toast. And I right away thought about Bath and Body Work. Because that's my favorite. I think it's Champagne Toast. Champagne something is my favorite. And I grabbed them. But I think I'm just going to use these as a giveaway. Uh, Sweet Floral Scented Champagne Toast Scented. Two hand creams. And look how cute is the packaging. So I grabbed that. And then I have two of these bags. The other ones, I'm already using it. But this one's for my bestie because she was looking for it too. So I grabbed her one. And guys, don't mind my nails. Don't mind my mess of nails. And then I fell in love with this one. Like this one has to be my favorite now. I love the contrast. Is that what it's called? Like the blue with the almost burlap looking. And then the hearts with the butterfly. Look at the butterfly. And it's just so beautiful. I was like, oh my God, this is just, has like the little, is that a birdie? That's a birdie. I almost said a fish. What's wrong with me? A ladybug. Oh my God, this is just beautiful. You can even like frame this if you wanted to put a nice frame, picture it in a nice frame. Or you can make a cute pillow on a nice little bench or something. Or in your little like, um, I have one of those like banana seats or whatever you call it. The egg shape. I don't know, guys. I don't know what I'm talking about. I never know what I'm talking about. But anyways, 
that one was my favorite so let's put these to the side and i have a collective haul guys of stuff that i left here that i never got to haul because of joelle's situation i had a mess i've been cleaning up this mess and get, gathering my stuff that i gotta pack and take back um but yeah guys i just and i'm gonna do that haul just so i can put the stuff away and still share with you guys because this is stuff that i'm sure you can still probably find i don't know and it was stuff that it was gonna be for my other channel because i i was gonna show you guys uh, my other channel which is gonna be um frugal looks with jay i believe is my other channel i don't know when i'm gonna be able to work on that channel hopefully sometime soon i don't know guys i really don't know but anyways so i bought this bag because i think it spoke to me guys it spoke to me and the color is pink and it's like it knew i was coming and it said everything will be okay everything will be okay so i have to do a thumbnail with that bag because it spoke to me that bag spoke to me i wanted the other one too but which is something like slay something slay i don't know i have a ton of pictures and by the time you see this video, I'm sure I put the pictures up. I found so many new things. Anyways, I got another one of these because I came home and my family had the other one looking like a hot mess express by my air fryer. And I was like, that is gross. What is wrong with you guys? Like, I, this is not how I teach you guys to live. <laughs> but anyways, I grabbed another one so I can throw the other one out because it is a mess. And so that's going I'm underneath my air fryer. I grabbed Takis for my son. He requested Takis and we got Takis. And then Bestie wanted this cute little bright pink bag because she's going to she's gonna be working. Um, she's doing a wedding for someone and she's making a gift for the bride. So when I can help her with something, I'll, I'll pick it up and give it, get it for her. So I got her that one. And Bestie, I have another one that I grabbed for myself. But Bestie wanted this color. The little orange leaf and it's just like a little piggy bank with the little key and the lock how beautiful is this like what and this one says i'll take you to the candy shop doesn't that remind you of 50 cent there yeah that's what it reminds me i don't know and i didn't get nothing special but i like to disinfect my kitchen every time i clean it and wipe it's just you know you have meat and all that stuff and it just gets yucky and gross and i start thinking about it and guys so i grabbed me some kitchen cleaner comet classic with bleach that's going to my kitchen and you get 24 ounces oh my god guys it's gonna be a large haul so i hope that you are prepared because we are 12 minutes in because i talk a lot and this is a super large haul i went in there to buy my husband and i went in there because we're looking for that palm olive spray thing that is like the dawn and I couldn't find it and we end up leaving the store spending like $65 later. I just went for like, if I would have found them and there was a lot, I wanted like two or four to keep in my stash because I want that, you know? I've been wanting to buy the Dawn, but I'm a cheap ass. So I've been thinking about it. And when I saw that they had the Palm Olive, I was like, this girl needs to find it, but I didn't find anything. So, but I still find a lot of wish lists for Bestie and I. And, I've been looking for this fishy over there because one, I'm an Aquarius, and two, you're probably like, what does that have to do with anything? I don't know. You know, my thing is with water and all that. Usually you see fish. I don't know. I have a little DIY that I wanted to do with that little thing that Bestie brought me. If I remember, I'll post a picture here, and I want to hang him there from there and then just put him somewhere on my, my little wall by my bench or something. And I got Charlie's favorite, the sweet potato, because he's been missing mommy, so I got to spoil him. I got him his favorite sweet potato chicken. Little snacky snack. Don't come back. I don't know what I'm saying, guys. Don't listen to me. So, I found some of these. Bestie really wanted these. So, I got her two. She wanted the little square beads, which I can't find anywhere. So, she wanted the little boxy looking ones. So, I got her two. That's going for Bestie. Let me put Bestie stuff on the side so I can just pack it and take it home with me, honey. Okay, that goes to Bestie. And then I only grab one for myself because I have so many beads. And plus, I bought things to make more beads. So, I just bought one for myself. You know, I keep saying, I bought this, I bought that. 
hob hobby box. <laughs> hobby box. And I grabbed these for Bestie and I. Let me see if I find them all so I can show you guys. Oh, Charlie got two, honey. He got two because he's special. So I got two of these because I got one for myself, one for Bestie. But Bestie sent me a whole bunch of beads at one time. And I'm like, do I really need those beads? But you know what? These have smaller size that you can connect with the little bigger ones. With the little bigger ones. Anyways, you got 125 wood beads. So I got one for her, one for myself. Because you get all different sizes, like the little tiny ones. The bigger ones, the medium ones. How perfect is that? So that goes to Betsy, that goes to me. And I found these. You get 30 counts. How cute. You used to get the colorful ones before that you have to paint if you wanted them. Now they give you the wood looking ones. This is perfect. This will even look cute in a little like bow, in a little white bow or something with little greenery laying around. Guys, you could do whatever you want with these things. So you get 30 in there, one for Busty. And then I got this one too. I got her one too. You get 15 count. This is the darker beads. I should have got one more. But anyways, so that, like that. And let me see if I find the other beads. Anyways, and I found this cute little frame. That I think I'm just going to put Charlie's picture and put his name up here. It looks like a little doggy house to me. That's why I was like, oh, I want to put Charlie's picture. And this is a three by two. So, yeah, I want to put Charlie up here. And then his, I got a cute little picture where he's looking out the window. So I'm going to do that for Mr. Charles. And what else, guys? What else do I have? bessie has been looking for this like crazy. The rainbow macrame kit. And I got it for her for the babies room, I'm assuming. For my little Lulu. And speaking about Lulu, I got her. She, Bessie's been looking for these and I finally found it. The kids storage bag. Look how cute. So you can just put this. I thought this was for the bathroom, but I guess you can put it anywhere. It comes with two little suction cups. Angela Mine, BPA free. So yeah, I got that one for Bestie. And then I got this one for Sainty, the little bear. And I got this for my car because I have my car is all black and I thought, how cute. Little air freshener. I mean, the driver's choice is not all that, but I know the video is long, but let's do a review, shall we? Let's see if it smells like anything. But it's just cute, even if it doesn't smell all that, you know? Even if the smell is gone in two days, like whatever. It smells scent like, like um. It smells like citrusy, and I'm not a big fan of citrusy, but it's not that bad. Oh, it's lemon, citrusy lemon. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of citrus stuff, but it'll do. And it has a little sticky thing inside, so it won't be moving back and forth. But I'm gonna put this in my car, and I'll leave it there afterwards because. The sound will be gone in two seconds, honey. Two seconds. And then I found... Let's see this for last. I grabbed this one for myself because it says money can buy me love. So I got this one for myself. And I usually put, like, I like to put... Every time I get paid, well, I'm not... I'm not, I, not that I don't work because my job was nice enough it gives me close to a year to be with Joel and then come back to my job but I'm not getting paid like that all the time but I usually like to put money away for Christmas and have my little stash you know hidden but this one comes with a little key and I was like oh my god adorable hold on guys charge this camera in a minute and I think it's gonna give up on me and then I found these in the little candy um the little party area you know how we found the big ones the really big ones and then the smaller ones but i found two little mini ones that you can also lay there like that and put like little candy and stuff but i'm gonna use these for my i have a whole bunch of little stud earrings that go all over the place and i was thinking i can just throw them in here and um store them in my little um bin that i put my jewelry in i could just set it like this with my studs or I can put all those little beads that I 
bought so I can take them out of the packaging and have my beads in here. How cute is this, honey, for $1.25? All right. And I was looking for this PBC Soap Saber. You know how you put your soap in a freaking bathroom and it's like sliming and all over the place and it's gross? I throw my soap out. I'm not going to lie to you. So I thought this was nice to just keep it there. It won't slide everywhere. It just stay put and the mess will stay in there. And you get two for $1.25. How cute is this? So I got that for myself. And I'm supposed to use purple shampoo. I'm going to get better shampoo, guys. But for now, I got the Power Stick Pure Sulfate Free Color Protection with Lavender and Chamomile. Ultra Blonde Revive Shampoo. Neutralizes brass, brassiness. <laughs> Anti-fade shield. And you get 6.5 ounces. I only got the shampoo because that's all I saw. I don't think I saw. I think I only saw that one. I don't know. And here are the other beads. Like I said, for Bessie. And the other beads for me, I think. I don't know. And I love these wipes. So I got some because we don't have any in my bathroom. That means that my daughter got to be modest disposable wipes, washcloths, alcohol free. So you get 18 large. These are pretty large, guys. Pretty large. Let's do a review, shall we? Just in case you haven't realized or haven't, you don't know how big these are, look. And they smell amazing, honey. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. But look at this, and they smell so good. So, so good. So these are perfect if you just wanna freshen up really quick, you know, like um, for anything, guys. If you go to the bathroom or if you're like, you know, you work out, and you don't you want to like just wipe down really quick while before you shower because you can't shower right away for anything you can freshen up i just keep these in my bathroom okay all right and um my daughter i mean not my daughter what am i talking about i needed some this is not a deal for dollar 25 anymore it was better when it was a dollar okay but so i would then complete smells pretty good and i needed some just to do my laundry really quick and so that way i don't leave nothing dirty because my husband's gonna be out there and the boys and my daughter for like almost three months so we want to leave everything secure clean fresh whatever we need to take care of we can take care of it and my daughter needed some dots she needed some dots guys i hope you're still with me because i know this is a long haul my daughter needed some B pure non-medicated acne blemish things. These work pretty good for us. So everybody uses them here. You can get these at Family Dollar for a dollar. But we wear Dollar Tree and I got them. All right, guys, new items. New item check, okay? If I remember, I'm gonna post some pictures. Hopefully, because there's too many pictures. But they had different colors. They had a pink unicorn. They had like a little orange. I don't know what it was. I don't know if it was a tiger or what. A lion. I don't remember, guys. But they had so many cute ones. I grabbed the elephant ones for my grandkids. This one with the little bow. And then the cute little four-piece cups. Maybe this should be my thumbnail. How cute is this? Yeah. I was like, oh my God, they're adorable for my grandbabies. Because, you know... I'm a nana to the heart and I will get them whatever. And then I found this pretty animal mask bar. It's supposed to be an octopus, I guess. I grabbed this from my granddaughter because she loves to do masks with me. And I was like, how fun is this? She's going to love this. And this is not by Greenbrier. Made in South Korea. Korean stuff is very good stuff. But anyways... Like stuff made in Korea, you know? I hear that it's great stuff. So yeah, I got that from my grandbaby. And being that I have this hair now, honey, I got myself a brush because I don't have a brush like this. And I use my husband's now to keep all his bed heads down, whatever you call those. But yeah, so I just grabbed myself a brush. It says, grow and groom family brush. 
and it feels really nice it's a little hard but i prefer a nice hard dirty brush than crappy brush that i can do nothing to my hair all right guys and we got i got the manetta manetta luxury cream moneta moneta luxury cream vanilla cookies and i got the chocolate for my kiddos to put in their pantry so they can snack away snack their lives away and my last thing guys i think this is my last thing i don't know it seems like i i don't know i thought this haul was gonna be way longer than this but my last thing guys i was shook i was like dollar tree no you didn't and there's a lot of stuff that dollar tree has that i still haven't found <laughs> but i found these guys i found tresemme tresemme pro collection the keratin shampoo nice full size honey and then i found the what is this botanical i cannot see that coconut oil and aloe vera this is the keratin smooth with marula oil i don't know guys what is dollar tree doing to us <laughs> But anyways, you get 13.53 ounces. And these are both shampoo. I did not find any conditioner, but I'm okay with that. Because this is a deal. Because Tresemme, as we all know, it is expensive. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I'm just excited to be here with you guys. <sighs> I just get my mind off of things for a little bit sometimes. You know what I mean? But yeah. And that is it, guys. Oh, no, that is not it. I have stuff on my lap. Hold up. Wait a minute. So I found they have a cute. Maybe I can post a picture of that, too, if it's not already in my community tab. If I forget, go check my community tab. It's going to be loaded with new with pictures of a lot of stuff. But they got this pride stuff going on there. And they had this pride love is love hair elastic that I'm going to take to Amaya June. For her pony because how cute and what little girl doesn't like a rainbow oh my god you know what this reminds me of my girl Kellen Kellen is gonna lose her when she sees all this rainbow stuff and then they had the rainbow lip gloss by be pure they had another one but I only grabbed this one let's see guys let me see how this is I'm just gonna give you reviews a haul we're just gonna do it all honey it smells good it says berry scented. Mm hmm. Feels nice. Doesn't taste very. I don't like to taste my lipstick or lip gloss, but this, this went in there, honey. Look how pretty, though. I love it. I should have saved it from Maya. And then I got. Pride, love is love. I got phone grip and stand. Phone grip and stand. Oh, I guess you can. So I got this one. And then I got this one here. It says, oh, love. Well, it's upside down, but. And how cute. They have more. So if I remember, I'll post a picture here. If I remember, if not, go to my community tab. Go to my, click my picture. Go to the, on the top community. And then you'll see all the stuff that I post there. But that is it guys that is finally it now i can put all this stuff away because i have another haul in front of me a hot mess of a haul of a whole bunch of stuff i might just do it tomorrow i don't know but if you see me like this means that i just went with it i went with the flow but that is it guys thank you so much for watching thank you so much for your love and your support remember that i love you so so much don't forget to be kind forgive love one another make new memories and i'll catch you guys on my next one bye